Page 134 in your textbook, I just wanted to draw your attention to it. It gives a really good review of how to use a protractor. So if you have any trouble remembering what to do or experiencing some trouble measuring angles, you can go back to those pages 134 and 135 and review it. So I measured a couple of angles with you on the page that I had printed out, um, and they were all either um, acute angles, right angles, or obtuse angles. So they were either less than 90 degrees, exactly 90 degrees, or greater than 90 degrees, but less than 180 degrees. So I had a question from a student last week. What would you do if you had to measure an angle that was greater than 180 degrees since our protractor only goes up to 180 degrees? So... It's actually quite simple to do, and you can see it outlined on page 135 in your text, which I'm showing you here. What we do is we measure the opposite angle, okay? So we are going to measure not this angle, but not the angle that is um, mentioned that we're being asked to measure, but we're going to measure the opposite angle, okay? So you can see I've outlined that angle in blue. So the illustration shows the protractor on top of the angle and the measure of that angle, um, the opposite angle to the one that we're asked for is 135 degrees, okay? So now we know the opposite angle of the one that we were asked to measure is 135 degrees. And if we look at, whoops, that little arc that I drew to demonstrate the angle that we are supposed to be measuring, you can see it almost makes a circle. If I did a better job of drawing with my mouse, it would be a circle. And a circle has 360 degrees. So to figure out what the opposite angle is to the one that we measured, we do a little bit of simple subtraction. We know there's 360 degrees in a complete turn. And if we subtract the 135 degrees from the opposite angle that we measured, we're left with 225 degrees. And we know that that is what the opposite angle is. So the reflex angle is equal to 360 degrees minus its opposite angle. And in this case, that works out to 225 degrees.